So the van and I have officially entered Yellowstone National Park, and this place is absolutely stunning. I mean, the view, the rivers, I mean, this is stuff I've only ever seen on TV. So of course, like two minutes into Yellowstone, it starts raining, but that's okay because there are bison right over there, right out the window. And so um, this park is kind of catered to people viewing from the road, which isn't really my thing, but when it's raining, shoot, I'll take it. <laughs> oh, no way, it's hail. That is hail out there, that is not rain. That's why it sounds so funny. All right, so I've seen my first bar right over there, and um, that's pretty cool. Um, problem is, whatever, wherever there's animals, there's also like a ton of people. But so far, driving through here has been pretty productive with uh, all the bison, and then of course that black bear. So apparently right now is a really good time for some bison to graze at the edge of the road. And uh, some of these babies up here are even getting in the road. <laughs> and so, um, of course we have to stop for them because wildlife have the right of way. But this is just kind of funny. It's kind of a typical Yellowstone sort of thing to happen. So out here behind me we have two creatures that are just absolute icons of the of the plains. However, we're not exactly in plains. We're kind of in a valley right here. But regardless, there's a lot of sagebrush, a lot of good grazing land, and that's what's important to the bison and the antelope. Now the pronghorn antelope are just back here and they're all laying down and resting. And um, this is the only antelope we have in the US. And so it's kind of cool to see them out here because they're amazing runners. I mean, they can run at fast speeds for a very long time. So like where else in the world do you find Canada geese and bison hanging out together? <laughs> it's kind of cool. You know, it's just kind of unreal that I bought an $800 van, drove it all the way to Yellowstone, and now I'm sitting here next to a river hanging out with a bunch of bison and antelope, like pronghorn antelope. How cool is that? And there's some Canada geese over there. Like, this isn't a position I expected to see myself in. Oh. And there's a, there's a bison right next to my van over there. This is gonna be interesting. So if you ever come to Yellowstone, be sure you do not watch Man on a Buffalo because you're gonna be severely tempted to just jump on the buffalo and ride it. Because that's what happens in the video. If you don't know what I'm talking about, there's a link in the description below. Watch it, it's hilarious and it's just insane. Okay, how cool is that? So, um, back behind me in these hills, wolves are howling. I mean, real wolves. And when I first heard them, I thought they were coming in in that direction. But then once I got here, I heard them back behind me in these hills. But, um, and I heard them really clear back behind me. So, I don't know if there's two packs and they're howling at each other or different members of the pack. But um, I'm gonna hang out here for a little while and see what else I can hear. Wow, that is crazy. Wolves, real wolves howling back up in these hills. <laughs> now in the footage I'm showing to you now, this audio was terrible because there was people all around me talking and um, everybody had their snazzy jackets on and they were going, <laughs> So um, I'm gonna take the audio that I took before of the wolves howling and overlay that so you can just kind of get the full experience 
of what I experienced out here with the wolves. Even though I never saw one actually howl, I heard the howling, recorded that, and then I shot footage of the wolves themselves. And so um, I just want you guys to have the full experience and not the experience I had with people all around me um, with their loud snazzy pants and jackets and stuff and talking and things. I think a lot of these people are actually birders in disguise. They're acting like they're wolf watchers, but I think they're actually birders.